now two minutes to the distinguished gentleman from Texas and a member of the Intelligence Committee, Mr. Conaway. The gentleman from Texas is recognized for two minutes. Well, thank you, Mr. Chairman. I appreciate the uh, chairman that. I hope those aren't mutually exclusive. Uh, it's, um, so you can distinguish that from being from Texas. Uh, I rise in strong, strong support of this year's intelligence authorization bill. I encourage my colleagues, all of them, to support this. Uh, but with that strong support comes a modest amount of disappointment in that uh, through no fault of anyone in particular, no one's fault, we had to strike, the chairman was, made the tough decision to strike Section 412 from the bill, which would have allowed uh, certain elements within the intel community to set up their own direct accounts with Treasury. It's a bit of an arcane statement, but it allows uh, the greater steps toward achieving auditability across the, intel the intelligence community. The uh, provisions were intended to promote this goal of better financial accountability uh, and insight into our classified spending. The intelligence community, Mr. Chairman, must meet the same financial accounting standards as the rest of government. Uh, those accounting standards will help <coughs> uh, uh, uncover savings and current programs that can be reinvested in vital uh, intelligence priorities or returned to the taxpayers. So while I am disappointed that the uh, provision was not in the 2011 bill, uh, I've, got, uh, I've already had uh, good conversations with the chairman reference to the 2012 bill, which will be in, in committee in the next uh, few week, next couple of weeks, so that uh, we can continue to move the intelligence community, their various uh, slots, toward accountability, which is important for the, uh, for the taxpayer, and it gives management a, a reliable tool uh, if they've got those systems, got the internal controls in place, uh, give them, it, it will give them tools uh, in order to manage uh, the money that uh, the precious resources that we take from the taxpayers and uh, entrust to the intelligence community to do the great work that we've done, uh, that they have done, excuse me, uh, over these, uh, these past, uh, past years. No greater example of that, of course, than the, uh, the find and fix uh, portion of the uh, bin Laden exp experience that, uh, that we saw play out on uh, May 1st and 2nd. Uh, a, a terrific achievement uh, by folks whose faces will never be seen, whose names will never be known, except to them and their colleagues. We'll, they'll know who they are. They'll have that great pride of knowing that they've done great work for this country using the tools that, uh, that we provide them. So I urge my colleagues to support the uh, reauthorization bill, and I yield back. The gentleman yields back. The gentleman from Michigan Reserves, the gentleman from Maryland is recognized.